guys have any conversation with him at halftime? Nah, his dumbass coach just started calling his play plays more, when calling his number more. <laughs> <laughs> No, uh, but no, you know, he and I have talked, and I told him I'm, I'm a force feeding man, and just be aggressive. Don't worry about it. Just be aggressive going to the rim. And he did that tonight. You know, he had a swagger about him. He, he wasn't settling. You know, he's one of the best mid range shooters I've ever been around. More than capable of knocking down threes. But again, he was loving and living in the paint tonight. And that's the AD we need. That's the AD that's going to, that aggression and him forcing uh, his will, forcing him to, knowing they can't guard him, to foul him. Um, it, it speeds up the process of us getting into the bonus, and that helps everyone else. So now it's a block and foul out on the perimeter. Austin gets to go to the free throw line. D'Lo, Dennis, Bees, these guys, and if they've been struggling a little bit with their jump shot, they get to see a couple go in. Hopefully we missed 10 free throws tonight. But uh, hopefully they get to see their shot go in, and it helps boost their confidence, and it just has a ripple effect up and down the roster. Uh, 